bottom boys a bottom boys bottom boys coming at you bottom boys coming at you bottom boys 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 I wish I, I I wish I had the confidence to join in on that one just because it looked it, looked it was more, very it chaotic. very fun. Uh, yeah, yeah it <laughs> we was, do it every time. It was maybe more fun than it was good, but it was very fun. <laughs> <laughs> Is that the same song every week? Oh no, uh, it, it's uh, it's it's always no. a remix. it's a rotating. Yeah, that song. was that, okay, was, that was the Brandon every Murphy time. remix. Oh, oh, that's right. And for everyone watching, this is our boy Brandon Murphy. Hello. Uh, <laughs> welcome to the Bottom Boys bottom cast, boys. Brandon. Uh, Brandon uh, is like the first friend I made in comedy ever. Uh, me and Brandon started open mic like within weeks of each other. Yeah. Uh, we used to do shows together. We used to travel through fucking small town podunk ass Kansas together. Mm-hmm. Uh, we used to and the, we d- used to have a monthly show we ran for yeah. years. Uh, and R.I.P. R- Lucha Raptor. Lucha Raptor. Oh, yeah. R.I.P. Lucha Raptor. Days. R.I.P. And now we're here. Uh, what are you up to, Brandon? Sitting here. Yeah. That's all I got. I got that's, that's what he's up to. What are you drinking? Uh, Cider Boys. So Bottom Boys meets Cider Boys. Uh, Ooh. It's, the, it's the mashup Ooh, we've always Cider wanted. Boys. Hey, that, and, and, yeah, I'm into yep. this. Cider Boys, hit us up. I'm, I might be sober, but we can make Paul drink some. I also just realized the calories is 204. Oh, whoa. <laughs> oh, that wow. is a chocolate bar right there. <laughs> well, I've never seen something... Have it's an, just oh, like, I've never seen it's this. syrup. Yeah, I've You're never seen it that. Syrup. Is it thick? It's, I mean, as thick as it can be. It's, it's, a, it's, it's a thick ass cider. <laughs> it's, it's got, it's got some, it's got it's some heft. She's a, it, she's a thick girl. She's a thick girl. She's a thick girl. So we got that. <laughs> uh, today, today on the bottom, boys, uh, we're gonna prove just how smart we are, uh, <laughs> because that's what we're getting to the bottom of. We're getting, bottom <laughs> we're getting to the bottom of how smart are we, and not just that, but smarts kind of in general, right? Like we just want to talk about, like you know, the different types of smarts. Like, what does it mean to be smart? How do you prove that you're smart? And really, before we jump into it. <clears throat> I asked Brandon a handful of questions, <laughs> uh, and one of them was, when you come into town, what do you want to talk about? What do we want to get to the bottom of? Now, uh, this came out of one of the subjects he brought up, but there was another subject he wanted to make sure we at least touched on uh, before we dove in. And what was that other subject you uh, you asked about? Well, you guys you guys seem like investigative journalists. Uh-huh. If I, yeah, I have a hat. Most, I've yeah. got a the most. hat somewhere here yeah. and a spyglass. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I believe that we should have got to the bottom if Stevie Wonder was blind or not. Oh. Because I, 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 so. I'm part of a blind gate, of, of, of Wonder Gate. He just wonders. I just uh, wonder. The blind gate where you got to open it up he for him? He just wonders about the so he gets through I, I, it? I, I, so. I, have, I have no factual evidence other than he did... Uh, it was some kind of like uh, "We Are the People" type uh-huh. songs, and I, he caught a, he I caught remember a falling Tom light. Tom or... had a deal where he was like sh- showed that video over and over again, where the mic was yes, falling. And yes, would catch it. Yes, and, uh-huh. and that's all my evidence is. And I, I was hoping that he caught a mic stand one time. Mm-hmm. Now he, he caught now, a mic stand. Now he can see. Yep, I t- he can no, see. I thought. I, remember that one time when they left him on stage? I don't remember who it was during what, but they just left him on stage and they really? didn't know what was going so, on. And so I feel like if he had the ability to see, there's no, no way. You, he's, just, uh, he's not just going to soak that cringe in and just get left on stage. No, but that's the worst way also to, like... I guess he doesn't want to blow his yeah, cover. Yeah, he's, like, <laughs> he's just sitting there, because, like... That also could be like a way to get back at him because he can't be like I gotta get up and leave because they're gonna like no. okay now now I I was made aware because Brandon and me have talked about this many, for many years he has always been a Stevie Wonder truther <laughs> uh, he has been he, he has always thought Stevie Wonder could see I was made aware of some new information finally uh, oh. today and that is Ooh. that. Your wife has met Stevie Wonder. She, my, she has confirmed he is blind. I, I, I that you can. I can meet Paul. Okay, and, yeah, and that doesn't prove he's a black belt. You know what I'm saying? Like, like <laughs> I know, but like, <laughs> but if you met but, Paul and he was like actively kicking people, it might help you. Like, yeah, it I might, believe. I, yeah, it might. It might. It might help your, con- your conclusion, but like. 
until I see. I get. I know it's illegal, but until so you, I see medical th- records, and so you think like, he was faking it with your. So you I don't think he's faking. He was faking okay. it with your wife. Great. <laughs> <laughs> you guys have that in common. <laughs> I got him. I. I'm, I, it's, like, it's also Stevie Wonder. You can't go to his face and be like, I don't believe you're blind, bitch. Like, you probably you could. Like... He's not going to remember what you look like because he's blind, <laughs> <Yeah>. Brandon. <laughs> Just start dropping stuff. So now that we've TV established a foundation of which of us are the smartest. Yeah. Uh... <laughs> I'm just saying, I, listen, it's, it's, that's like one of, that's the, like, I don't really care about conspiracy theories. Sure. I I don't care. Like if <laughs> aliens are real or not, I don't care. Uh-huh. Um but like um who was the who was that lesbian couple? All the things you said, all the things you said. Tattoo. That was tattoo. tattoo. Yeah. So when cuz we we were f- as as uh people who soak up the media. Yeah. Uh consumers. Consumers of the media. We saw they these these beautiful Russian women kissing at the MTV Music Awards, and we like these are lesbians, and then it turns out they weren't. Oh yeah, we that's, were, that's we true. Felt, that's we true. Felt we did get duped. We did get duped. Yeah, we felt betrayed by the Tattooed. music industry. So I'm thinking, oh, I, I have if the no music clue industry, you guys are talking about, either. you don't know. No, Jamie, can we pull that up? Jamie, uh, do we have a Jamie? All the things you said, <laughs> yeah. all the things you said, um, running through my head, running through my head, all, all the things, things you said. This is the. I don't even know that song. What well, year, year was this? Uh, this was about 90, 2001, yeah. maybe, maybe oh, 99, 98. I guess I should 90s, know about this. Yeah, you said yeah. MTV Awards. So yeah, I should for sure. Assumed. It was like it was like you know, it was around the time when WrestleMania was still yeah. cool, like back with Stone Cold and stuff. So it's it's less to do with Stevie Wonder and more to do with the the the, the scumminess of the. Of, of, of the inter- of, 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 of the entertain- of the, uh, yeah, uh-huh. there's oh. pedophiles there, and there's people who think who say that Stevie Wonder is blind. You know, they're all on the same page to me, and you know, we all are just. <laughs> <laughs> oh <laughs> God! Can we, damn. can we edit that out? Can I we... mean, I can. <laughs> I don't know if I will. I'll decide later. <laughs> uh, um, so, no, so t- let, but, but the, the other question you asked after Stevie Wonder was, uh, can dumb people? Be sapiosexuals, and I think that's how we're going to start going into smarts. We're going to talk about sapiosexuals, because I actually didn't know what that was. Uh, And it turns out a sapiosexual is someone who's turned on by smarts. Yeah. It's someone, mm. yeah, you, you, you like, you know, you lay them down, you're like, hey, A squared (laughs) plus B squared. Equals C squared, <laughs> and she's like, oh, ah, that, give, give me that D squared. The limit does not exist. <laughs> so the limit does right not now. exist. <laughs> the limit. So basically, Lindsay Lohan in uh, Mean Girls, sapiosexual. Okay. Oh. I actually, I think all the mathletes have to be sapiosexuals, right? Yeah. Like it's, it's like all the nerds in high school. We're fucking. All the band nerds were, oh, they were getting yeah, it on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's they all were, they. Yeah. yeah, they just put each other the mouth on each other's flutes constantly. <laughs> You're mm-hmm. telling me the mathletes couldn't figure out that one plus one equals two? Get the fuck out of here. Those guys were fucking. Those mathletes are fucking. But sapiosexuals. Can a dumb person be a sapiosexual? What do you think? I think I think they can't because it's like it's just that rules of like opposites attract. Sure. So like I, I And they get turned on by smartness too, so they don't have to be smart. Yes. They just have to think something is smart. But does it may but the person they're turned on by, uh-huh. do they have, have to be, be that smart? They just need to be smarter than the first person. Yeah, right? which wouldn't be that tough, right? Maybe because not. They're dumb. Yeah, I mean, maybe. A sapiosexual could be a smart person, too, though, right? Like, it could be like Stephen Hawking can only get turned on if you can, like, prove string theory to 12 dimensions. Mm. Yeah. But, or you like, push the button and he... Yeah, that's true. <laughs> yeah, that's smart. Actually, <laughs> the plug, plug, in the, plug in the deal. Yeah. <laughs> that would be the other way to turn them on. But I think I think dumb I think I think you're right. I think dumb people can be sapiosexuals because yeah, you sure. just have to find someone a little smarter than you. So like no, and now but how, not, but how often is that what what's going to get them going though? Like how often are you going to be sitting around and this person who can't read a book is going to be like you know what gets my muffin rumbling? Well, I, I, I <laughs> algebra. I, I, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because mm. yeah. it's it's also like. Um, so there's there's uh, I looked this up too. 
Uh, there's nine types of intelligence. Okay. It's uh, nine types. Oh wow! I have, I have a mirror. Right. I've got a. I have I've got a pen. I'm here. writing uh, stuff down. Uh -huh. There's. Uh, did you? Oh, did you guys notice the coat I'm wearing? Yeah, uh, you're very. Uh, I'm, I'm turned so on because I'm a dumb person. And, and, and the, our, our dumb savior. Yeah, yeah, I'm a dumb here's, here's, You do look smart. Thank, Thank you. you. Very smart. That's uh, why I wore this. What are you wearing for us today, Paul? What is this? This is just. I don't know where I got this at. Let me see. Let me look here. Old Navy. Oh, ooh. <laughs> Old Navy. That's, that's yeah. like Italian. I'm going to wear, if I wore the thinking cap, this is, yeah, Old Navy. Uh -huh. Ain't that new Navy. No, it's the old that's, Navy. yeah, that's the old country. Yeah, that's the. <laughs> Does this make me look smart if I wear the thinking cap? Yeah, no, I think, the honestly, cap, yes. I, I, my favorite the, part about your smart outfit, like, is not, not just the blazer, not the just thinking the, the thinking cap, yeah. but that you have decided to make sure to put on display the extreme intelligence of professional wrestling fans. <laughs> oh. Well, this is my, it's laundry day. I'm going to Seattle next week, and I don't have... Then yeah, oh. you gotta wash your Darby yeah, Allen yeah, shirt yeah, yeah. before you go to Seattle. <laughs> so all I have is this. I gotta, I gotta get my all best. You just got American Nightmare. I gotta get my best honky tonk man <laughs> pressed. <and laughs> head out. Okay. Well, uh, so a smart. Let's hear these. <laughs> let's hear is these nine smart? types of smarts. So the, the nine you look oh, pretty yeah. smart. Thank I you. Look in, I mean, I, look, I like you. what you did with the eyes too. That really the glasses. <laughs> the glasses are because I'm Chinese. Chinese people, yes, yeah, they do. They do look smart. They come off smarter, smart, yeah, yeah, because yeah, yeah, they go to school. Also, yeah. <laughs> that's a good point. This is an unrelated <laughs> thing. Gets you smart. Chinese people are strong as shit lately. I don't know if you know. I don't know if you caught Whoa, up with this. Really? Like in, in like in sports or something? Like in no, just in, in, like I, I I go to the gym. Uh, a lot. <laughs> so there's an Asian guy there that's lifting things. Dude, I I I no offense. Paul, but like no, I, I, I grew up with. You're calling his people strong. I, I think he's okay with it. Well, I grew up with like. You kind of no offense, but you were sort of like Asian culture was the butt of the joke of like we, they're very weak and submissive. I'm, and docile. I'm very strong. Yeah, Paul's yeah, no, super I'm strong. Very strong. Look how strong he is. But like, look at, look at this. I'm want, going to the look at I, if, I didn't have, if I didn't have this smart looking jacket on. <laughs> I've seen I would know, be I, I've I've seen smart, Paul, your veins oh, yeah. popping. I've seen Paul carry four, maybe even five grocery mm -hmm. bags at the same Ooh. at one time. I can do more than that <laughs> if they're the pla not not the paper ones, yeah, but like the plastic, so you can have a handle. Yeah, how many can you get? However many I can. Shoving these little tiny Asian fingers. <laughs> Hell yeah! I, I like guess. to even roll some up on my forearms. So. Oh yeah, that'll oh, happen that. too. Yeah, I'll I feel like, like Triple H. Yeah, walking yeah. In. <laughs> just like you're like getting <laughs> like Jesus coming in, <laughs> <laughs> carrying the cross. Oh, that's bad news. My just... body. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, so, <laughs> nine types of intelligence. Nine types. Nine types. types. So it's uh, the first one is um, uh, naturalist. So it's the understanding of living things, reading in nature. Okay, so naturalist. Okay. Um, musical people who like it's it's, yeah, it's okay. like you know Paul's arts. pretty musical. The arts. Are... The art, or is that not just musical in general? Because it, uh, there, there's a it's like there's a, a hearing. Smart. Got it. Yes. It's like an audio mm. smart. Yeah, yeah um, hearing smarts. I can't. Um, Getting deaf. You are yeah. you are losing oh, your hearing preach. a little. I'm right there, brother. Uh, logical <laughs> and mathematical. Ooh, logical so, math. Yes, that makes it, sense. It's more, uh -huh. but it's, like, it's yeah. It's the just sapiosexual people are yeah. into mm -hmm. that. That's the, that's what mm -hmm. they click on Tinder. <laughs> mm -hmm. uh, existential or existential? Ooh, existential. That's the type of crises I have. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so you're actually you're actually really smart, but because of because oh of god. Um. <laughs> Interpersonal. That's but that's also like okay, like yeah, you, like Riz. Feelings. That's your charisma. Yeah, your Riz. Yeah, charisma. Mm -hmm. uh, Got it. This one's cool too. Uh, like bodily. Okay. Like, 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 like ath athletes. Physical like intelligence. Yeah. Like yeah. my my me some musk coming like, off. Yeah, of yeah. Some <laughs> muscle <laughs> memory. Yeah, like not mu <laughs> <laughs> like musk. Musk scent. Smelly people yeah, are scent. not smart. <laughs> they might be. They might but be. You got musk but. coming off of you, and it's you're smelling smart. <laughs> Uh, smelling smart, girl. Uh, <laughs> linguistic. Okay. Oh yeah. So like, like if you know a ton of languages. Yeah. Like my good friend Claudio Castagnoli speaks five languages. That's a lot of languages. My wife speaks five languages. Yeah. There you go. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, intrapersonal. So in, inside, like understanding your wants and needs. So like, like if you go to therapy a lot, you probably have. Probably, Pretty yeah. good intrapersonal. Yeah, I will. It, it's like personal growth, right? Yeah. Like, okay. We'll hit on that topic in a second. Cause I, I, I have a little rant about uh, that that emotional intelligence or that okay. emotional maturity that's been spreading lately. I'm not Do a you, fan of. You're it. not a fan of emotional maturity. Okay, why? Well, let's hear it. It's it's less of it's it's less of it's less of the. 
I'm for growth in people. Sure, yeah. Always, always like progress. Yeah, you gotta, in life is yeah, good. gotta progress. But uh, this whole bullshit of like, just because you you know how to say I need space or save space for me, I'm not a fan of. I don't know if it's made it your way out to the Midwest, but on the West Coast, it, there's a lot of people who want you to save space for them. Okay. And there's also a lot of people like who making need... reservations, like 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 they want you to <laughs> like, give like give part of your energy, for, yes, like, save part yes, of your yeah. energy for oh. them. And I find it very just like narcissistic of just sort of just being like, well, it feels like you're enti- you're you're showing some of your entitlement to your relationships, Thank right? You. You're asking for something from so- you're expecting something from someone without. You know any real like input on their behalf? You're telling That's all it them. Is, yeah. You're telling them this is what I need and expect from you. Yeah. And I mean that can be fine, but I feel like the consequences of creating that sort of line or ultimatum are that that person can just end the relationship if they want to. If they're not willing to give mm-hmm. that space, cut them off. Don't give them the space. Yeah, and it's it's less. I mean, don't get me wrong. If you if you save space for your friends, you're a good friend. I'm just. <laughs> I'm just bitter about it. I got a, no space. I'm just bitter about it. I'm out day. of space. <laughs> <laughs> I, got, I got tons of space. And then uh, last is uh, spatial. Uh, spatial? S-P- spatial. 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 So that's like your your the ability world. to like see yeah. like organization and like how things fit together. Yes. So. Mm, Amber has go. really good spatial intelligence. Mm. She did one of these tests as a kid. And I mean, I believe it. She stacks... Like so much stuff into stuff. tiny yes. little spaces. Engin- like you can map stuff. the world. Like, you can map your surroundings. Like remember the world. when uh, we, it, yeah. we lived in the frigging guest house and somehow had the same amount of stuff we still have right now, but lived in like a hundred square feet and she had all these shelves and <laughs> yeah, that's. That's spatial intelligence. Yeah, that's living with a maniac. <laughs> that's, a, that's a psycho man. I don't know how much how you got all that stuff in that place. No idea. Well, I mean, now we have a lot more stuff because we were poor then, and now oh, yeah. I I'm not poor, but I'm making, I don't know how I, you I wait, fit. In I that. have enough money. I don't to know how you waste. fit into that. Place. Oh, that pl- yeah, no, I wo- <laughs> I wore that house. I was I was like probably forty percent bigger than I am now too. So like, yeah, that bedroom was just a belt. Yeah. Like, <laughs> Uh, so what type of intelligence do you guys have out of that list? Oh, what gosh. what types of intelligences do you have? I do not have oh, the physical intelligence. I said I was going to write them down, whatsoever. and then I, I, I got didn't. S- I'm okay at spatial stuff, right? Yeah. I, like I, I feel like I'm not good at it because I'm always around Amber, but I'm okay at it. Like I don't suck. Oh yeah, I can do that. I can do spatial stuff. Uh, you're pretty good at music. I think you got. I think you got really yeah, good. I, I have a, one, yeah. I have like a I got, small yeah, musical right. intelligence. I, like, sure. I, I I can sing and stuff. I'm okay at it. Yeah, like but I'm not like that's not like my great one. Um, you're good know. at the charisma stuff. Yeah, I think you're, that you're, might you be my guy. Very, yeah. you're very that might be my that might be my guy because like I can make myself seem smarter in other ways mm-hmm. just because I can talk. Like, yeah. I'll use words that someone else was using, and I'll be like, "Yeah, no, I'm I'm smart enough to know that yeah, word. No, I, good, I don't even know if yeah. I used it right." Dog, I'm egregious as shit. I know <laughs> yeah, yeah, fuck yeah, yeah I, I get that. this shit's so fucking yeah. egregious, baby. <laughs> I'm more of a number five, whatever number five was. That's the one. Uh, which one? What was number five? Number five. That's I, the one I am. Uh, <laughs> interpersonal. Oh yeah, mm, yeah. relationship. Yeah, that's, that's, uh, yeah. that's the charisma one. Yeah, okay, yeah. yeah. That. Told yeah, you. you. You are good at that. I wrote it down. <laughs> I've been I've been I've been working on my intrapersonal intelligence. Yeah. I've been working on that. I've been trying to what be What you want, what you yeah, need. Yeah, uh, you, you know, desire. just, you know, learning how to control like the system, right? Like you got to <laughs> learn it. Yeah, you got to learn how to like control the desire. <laughs> <laughs> like I'm saying, I figured the out how to stop being a fat. I, I, just, I, I, I figured out how to stop being a fat drunk. That's, it. that's, what, that's, all, that's what I mean. Is, is that like an empathy one? There is a there and was yeah, a no, there was an empathy, empathy one. one. That's yeah. interpersonal because it's it, it's it's yeah. it's understanding what someone's feelings are mm-hmm. and like you know like it's, it's it's not like sympathetic where you like, you feel sympathy for. A person. And if you don't know what any of those words meant, then you're probably not. You're not. You're, you have no you're not on a lot of the list. Which I, which <laughs> no. I feel like I'm that as, as far as like. Well, how far did you guys go in school, uh, Paul? You graduated college. Like, did you do masters or anything? No, and I didn't actually graduate. Oh, college. really? <laughs> yeah, how how close didn't. were you? I have a lot of credits. Of hours. Uh huh. Like a hundred and some hours. Oh, that's a lot. Uh, yeah, and but none of them. Like, I changed my they were uh, all major over the place. every. Yeah, every not much of a semester. And I would like, 
<laughs> Let me do this. And then I would switch. Mm-hmm. So you're not intro person. You don't know what you want. You're not that. Oh. You're, yeah. No. Yeah, he, you're, yeah you're, I guess. Was, yeah, he, that probably. Was, that was his yeah, you're right. voyage of self-discovery. Yeah, I joined the military just because I, well, I don't know what the hell. So I'll just join the military. And now he gets discounts on movie tickets forever. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Worth that's it. All he, that's all he went That's right. For. I'm bringing it out. I don't care. <laughs> yeah, I'm just like, yeah. I'm bringing Pretty that soon out. you're going to be able to do the 55 plus and the military. You're oh. basically going to get to go to the movies for free. Yeah. <laughs> How far did you go in school? Denny's, Brandon. watch out! <laughs> <laughs> I'm I I barely squeaked by in high school. Yeah, and it was like it was fifty fifty of me not caring, but also that sort of thing of like any any kind of there was a challenge. It was like I'm not gonna learn it. I'm just gonna get. I'm just gonna be like whatever. Like, yeah, it was just you, it was literally that, like it, you didn't care didn't enough to fuck. pursue yeah. anything. I get it. And but, then oh sorry, no, no, no. I. I squeaked by, and then I tried community college three times. Hell yeah! And uh, I, that's the point of community college, though. I, I went to Maple Woods when uh-huh. I was eighteen, and I went for one week and dropped all my classes because <laughs> I was like, I don't want to do this. Like, this is terrible. And then I tried again the next semester, and I joined it again when I was thirty-one. Yeah. <laughs> and now I'm on online school in another community college in Oregon. So Fuck yeah. Hell yeah, yeah, he's yeah. in school still. I'm, I'm I'm back, baby. What were you gonna say, Paul? Well, I was gonna say that even though I I didn't actually graduate, uh-huh. I actually for the well past thirty some odd years have been working in a as a like a chemical lab. He has been. I don't, so. I, I, that scares me too because he's a chem- <laughs> he is a chemist. Like chemists, like. Without a degree is kind of bizarre. Well, yeah, but I also mean, it's like that real world. You, you on the job right? training? That's what you're doing. What do real they teach? You? I, don't, I don't even know what you do. What do you? Can you divulge that? Is that? Can I, is yeah, that I mean, I can secrets? tell you. Is, is there, well, I can tell you. So I people, people like Patrick Mahomes call Paul, and they have. Like, I did get a call from Patrick Mahomes. You got a call from Patrick Mahomes. Yeah, yeah I did. Mm-hmm. And if they have things they need to dispose of, or if they he needed barrels, he needed. He needed them, a barrel. He, he drove by the. And saw that there was barrels. Place where I work, and he's like, "There's barrels. I'll call this place." He didn't say he's Patrick Mahomes, and then so then I was like, "Hey, huh. Paul, it's me. <laughs> yeah, exactly. hey, yep. um, you got those barrels?" <laughs> and then he's like, this, and "They looked on the collar, and it said Patrick Mahomes," and I was like, uh, "Everybody, it. come over and look at this." <laughs> <laughs> but you work in hazmat, right? Yeah, hazardous materials, hazardous chemicals. Yes. So he like tests the chemicals and disposes mm. of them and stuff. Mm. All right. Now, I also did not finish college, Paul. I was 18 credit hours shy. I was going to say, you were shy. super close, weren't yeah, you? Yeah, I was. I was 18 credit hours shy when I dropped out, which was probably pretty dumb, but that's okay. It worked out. I didn't finish college, but now they like teach what I do as a job Ooh. in college. Mm-hmm. Wow. So, hey, all those kids that I'm teaching in college, drop out. <laughs> it's drop yeah, out. That's Kanye hey. West. <laughs> <laughs> drop out. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Don't do that. I was very fortunate. Uh, so, yeah, I, I also didn't finish college. I did good in high school, though. I did, uh, I, I was, what, I think I was number three in my class. Um, That's good. Yeah, we had like 200 kids or something. I was, uh, yeah, I was, I was like... in competition for number one, but like, I was lazy even though I was smart, so I didn't do extra honors classes in senior year, and otherwise I would have been like tied at number one if wow. I if I would have taken yeah. those classes and done well, which I mean I might have. I don't know. When I was in high school, I think I was thirteenth. Thirteenth out of how many, Paul? Yeah. Well, we had fifteen people in <laughs> my graduating class. Do you, do you remember the names of the two you beat? Uh, those no, those because those died. guys. <laughs> yeah, they went to they just kind of drafted, dropped out, and went to. This wor- and went to work on the farm. Yeah, because they had been going to Votech or something. Oh, so yeah, they're yeah, like, yeah, yeah. yeah, let's just so get out of here. Let's get to HVAC. Going, yeah, so yeah. I think it was by default. <laughs> they, they just didn't want to keep you around anymore. Yeah. They just let you out. Yeah. <laughs> I don't even know why they counted. <laughs> to why be they? honest, they, it's just going to make you feel bad if you're right. <laughs> why they told you what number yeah. you were? Yeah. yeah, that's pretty rough. Did they really tell you? I didn't. I never. Yeah, had, I, I did. They had tell you. So your your uh, high school diploma was a participation trophy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but hey, but look at me now. <laughs> Hell yeah! I got this Didn't thinking call cap. From Patrick Mahomes. You <laughs> got, got a thinking thing, cap. I got, I got this thinking got cap. This close friend Patrick Mahomes. I got close friend. We have Patrick so many Mahomes very close drums. personal famous friends. It's crazy. Oh. <laughs> Okay, okay. Well, we're going to test smarts. That's what we're going to do. Oh, we're testing smarts. We're going to test smarts. I got this book here. Uh, It's actually a 
a Twitter notebook, RIP, from when I got to go to the Twitter headquarters when that was still a thing. Um, they actually they tried to hire me to be the tweeter in chief one time. Well, <laughs> they interviewed me for it. They didn't try to hire me for it. You would have, you would have been so rich. I, oh, you would man, have been imagine. So rich. Imagine. Before you, before you get started on that, though, I did Uh-oh. get a quote oh. just earlier because I was watching uh, uh, Hard Knocks uh-huh. and Aaron Rodgers was on there and he had a quote that I thought applied and he, and he said, the quote, he said, you, you can't fix stupid. <laughs> Shut he up. said that. He said his dad told him that, actually. Oh, wow. But yeah. And so... <laughs> I think that's what we should be doing today. Fixing Trying to stupid? fix it? Fixing stupid. Okay. Okay. So basically what we need what you need to do to fix stupid is target all nine of those types of intelligence yeah. and oh, get yeah. better at them. Like uh, that's how you increase your attributes. Oh, I guess we did it, Aaron Rodgers. <laughs> Fuck you. We're fixing stupid, with Aaron. <laughs> We're fi- to be fair, he could have yeah. fixed stupid. Yeah. He just was too He's, stupid to yeah. accept it. He did say that, but he was also coughing with COVID. <laughs> <laughs> So, he said that, but he was also... Yeah. It was tough to understand him saying that quote. Literally but well in the just... middle of a ayahuasca <laughs> trip. So, <laughs> he, was, he was doing this wellness retreat. Okay, guys, we're going to do trivia. 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 That's what we're going to do. It's, that's, a, that's a form of intelligence, remembering facts, remembering things. Mm-hmm. And so this, this, <laughs> this round of trivia is called Three Things. Three Things. Three things. I'm going to list three things, mm-hmm. and you're going to tell me the person... That is connected by those three things. Oh, oh man, I thought you were going to give us multiple choice. Is it oh, man? No. Are they famous I'm gonna people? Give you, yes, okay, these are famous okay. people. Famous people. Uh, right. I'll start off with uh, a not so hard one Super Bad, Zombie Land, Bird Man. Oh, who? Superman, Zombie. Super Bad. Super, oh, Super Bad. Man. Super Bad, <laughs> Zombie, zombie Land, Land, Bird, Bird Man. Man. Yes. Hmm. It's uh, what's her face? It uh, is. The, uh, what is her damn name? The uh, the the blonde girl. Yes, e- she's EGA not blonde or anymore. No, now, or she wasn't blonde then. She was red. She's red in those. Yeah. yeah. Oh. Um, she also she's Spider-Man. been blonde also. Yeah, yeah. Emma Stone. Emma Stone. Emma Stone. Emma Stone. Emma Y'all knew it. I, Y'all knew I, it. You just didn't, didn't think of her know name. it. You just didn't think of her name. Okay. Okay. Let's let's get literary. All right. Let's get literary. We'll go back to pop culture. I'll probably be better. But I can do it. I'm gonna say yeah. I can do literary. Willy Wonka. Yeah. Matilda, Matilda, and James and the Giant Peach. James and the Giant Peach. Uh, chocolate. No, there's no chocolate. In James and it's a person. Peach. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah. Were they all uh, written think... by the same person? Is they that... are. Oh. But I, I That's can't our friend remember. Roll Doll. Our good friend Roll, Roll Doll. Oh. I couldn't remember. Shout out name. to Roll. Couldn't remember. All right. Let, let's never, break it down. Here we go. Matilda, but this is this one. You should be able to get. Uh, red. Red. Reputation. Reputation. Folklore. Red reputation folklore. Folklore. Come on, guys. Folklore. Red. Red reputation and folk. Come on. Red reputation. I'm gonna. Folklore. An entire fan base is gonna cancel us. It, I, mm. She's literally the biggest star on earth right now. Oh. Billions oh, and billions. Taylor of Swift. Yeah. Taylor Swift. <laughs> oh, that. Yeah. I don't. Yeah. I, I only know the Red <laughs> album. I. Yeah. Yeah, Red was yeah. one of her albums. Reputation was one of her albums. Folklore yeah. was one of her albums. I apologize. I that's know, okay. That's okay. That's okay. I don't I'm feel gonna like I'm one. in her demographic, but yeah, we're gonna I, find one. You're probably you probably are not her target demo. I like Anse Hero. That's the only song I like by her. You might get this. You might like get it. this. Uh, let's see. Wipeout. Okay. Wipeout. Bumblebee. Bumblebee. And Fred Three Camp Fred. <laughs> well. <laughs> I know this from two of them. <laughs> I don't know about Fred Three Camp Fred. <laughs> Was that <laughs> was was that a made straight for nothing? Yes, it was. It was on the Camp it was on Fred? Nickelodeon. Uh, fr- <laughs> do you know yeah. who it is? I, I do. I knew it. Who, who is, is it? it? John Cena. John, John Cena. Cena. That's right. It, it uh, was John Cena. Uh, yeah, I'll do one more trivia round. We won't do three things. I feel like we'll, we'll go. We'll go pop culture. Every pop culture. For I feel like every pop contestant culture. that played against uh, what was, was it Ken in uh, Ken Jeopardy? Jennings. <laughs> like that dude just <laughs> ruled everybody, and everyone's just like, "I'm just here." For Ken it. Jennings. Yeah, I'm Ken just Jennings. here for publication. He's uh, so this is TV Land. We're doing old sitcoms. Okay, old sitcoms. That's uh, in my uh, that's wheelhouse. This was literally we were singing the theme song before it came on. What city does Cheers take place in? What city? Does Cheers take place in Pittsburgh? Oh. Oh, no, it's no, not Pittsburgh. No, it is not Pittsburgh. But I always think it's Chicago, but I don't think it's Chicago because I not. think it's in 
it's in a, like a New England city. It's like Boston or something. It is Boston. Oh, yeah. Boston. Okay, yeah. okay. Here go, you go. Sox. This is this is your uh, your time frame, Paul. <laughs> What's the name of Jan Brady's fake boyfriend on the Brady Bunch? <laughs> His, his, his name is well. Let's see. His uh, last name is Glass. It is Glass. Wait, what? Yes. His he, last name is Glass because she looked at the glass on the, the table glass when she was named Glass. Him. Ira Glass. No, <laughs> if oh, only. No. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> this yep. Brady yeah. life. There was a George Glass. George Glass. George, yeah, George Glass. And then you trying to figure out Glass. Like glass. Yeah. There you go. Okay. <laughs> what company does George Jetson work for on the Jetson? Oh. What what does he even do? Hey, sprockets, right? Spacely sprockets or something Spacely like that? Spacely space sprockets. Spacely there you go. Space sprockets. Okay. Man, what I said it around. Were they, were, they, hold on. Oh. Were, they, were the Jetsons rich? They had a, they had that robot made. I think everybody had a robot made. I was going to say, yeah, was I think that, he was, was supposed common? to be middle class. I don't okay. even know who the poor people like, were there. Uh, now that I think the, about the it. The poor people lived on the ground. Oh. The Flintstones are the poor people. Oh, the Flintstones are the poor people. Yeah, they were cavemen. Barney Rubble. I love that. So you're either spaceman or caveman. Yep, that's in how this it works. world. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. What yeah. hospital do they work at in Scrubs? Mm. Oh God, I haven't seen that show in. I've never really watched years. Scrubs, so I'm gonna say. I'm going to say Saint Elsewhere. S- uh, Sacred Heart, but Saint Elsewhere is a good one. I like okay, Saint Elsewhere. That's I'll give nice. you one more. One more. <laughs> okay. Who? What was? Tim the Toolman Taylor's neighbor's name on Home Improvement. Oh my, uh, George Wilson. There it is. Wilson. Okay, Wilson. Wilson. I was just. I, was, I don't think I, he had even another name. So Did he just Wilson. Just Wilson. So trivia round. Trivia I'd round. I'd say uh, we, we aren't we, great. We feel, no. I feel dumber. I feel worse uh, yeah, about myself. My brain hurts a little even just from reading the questions. <laughs> we weren't bad. I don't think we were bad. You were fine. You, you did were... better. You did better than Brandon. Oh, yeah. I was not well, good. Well, you, you were doing old things, though, too. Sure. Old people okay. Things. Well, that's like a young person. What thing, did we like... miss? Just freaking... Uh, like everything. <laughs> See, I don't care. get a single one of <laughs> the three things. What are you talking things? about? We did, too. I got, your, I got John Cena. You I didn't got, get John Cena. I couldn't, I couldn't think of Emma Stone's name. The it fact was, that you got glass was very good. Blanks. You did my... get glass. What three things didn't we get? Oh, all we right, did I'll get pull the it up. I'm gonna. All right. I'm For not God's even sake. gonna rewind. I'm gonna. I'm gonna. We're gonna talk. We're gonna see. Because memory is probably a smart thing too. Where's three things? Yeah. Well, I'm. Yeah. I don't have that you anymore. Three things. I thought you were gonna do like Disease. the the test of they you, you say three choice. things. That's what we we're yeah, hoping. You guys you... didn't get. <laughs> Taylor Swift. We did say Taylor. Well, after a clue, you gave a clue. You didn't get Taylor Swift. You didn't get Rolled Doll. I did say Taylor Swift. Emma Stone. I did say Taylor Swift. I did say Emma Stone, but I just didn't say Emma Stone. I knew who it was. You got Taylor Swift after I told you she was the one billionaire famous person in the world. And I only know the album Red. Okay, fine, fine, fine. The View, Eddie, Theodore Rex. Whoopi. It's Whoopi! Whoopi Yeah! (laughs) Yeah! And the, Fuck you, Matt Keck. We are smart as yeah, fuck. I'm proven wrong. Whoopee. Proven I only knew that because of Theodore Rex. <laughs> That's all I, I heard Theodore uh, Rex. So uh, her granddaughter was on season one of Claim to Fame. Uh, and when she got off, she did the whole, fuck y'all. <laughs> fuck everybody in the house. And it was very funny to me. Like that she was the one. That, <laughs> yeah, that like, was the she one seemed that... chill the whole time. And then that shit happened. She was just like, nah, fuck everybody. <laughs> <laughs> Which was one of the best exits until uh, the new season. Tom Hanks uh, or his Tom niece Hanks girl? Go goes Lord. out on the first episode, throws a wild fit, and she's like, "I deserved more camera time." <laughs> and I was like, "They put a damn girl. bench out there." <laughs> There's never been another movie about a bench. There's never been a movie <laughs> with a bench in it. <laughs> You gotta, you gotta, if you really want to see good, good goodbyes, you gotta start watching RuPaul's Drag Race. Ooh, yeah, uh, yeah, oh, yeah. I watch RuPaul. Sashay away. I Miss love that Vanjie. <laughs> Miss Vanjie. Miss <laughs> Vanjie. Oh, my, my wife and All I watch stars. <laughs> The All Stars is what I watch. Oh, mm. look at you. Well versed. Top, well, it's the top only shelf thing. drag queen I don't get content. the other ones. I don't get the other channel or whatever. Oh, um, okay, okay. So, I'm gonna watch it I think I have it. If you want to, if you ever want to binge sometime, let me know. It's great. We'll do a whole episode on getting to the bottom of Bruce Paul's drag race. Okay, yeah, we gotta get the bottom. Sure. <laughs> Who we'll do it? Who are these people? Do you guys have any more ideas on how we can get smarter? Uh, oh, like... I actually, I have came up. I that you say that. <laughs> oh shit. Um, I actually came up with a. It's short. Okay. But okay. It's a uh, short. It's a test. Mm. It's an IQ test. Oh, is this a, okay. and I, like 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 the ones you can get online and stuff. 
Um, what is your idea? You can get them Have online. Have you ever taken? Do you remember the last time you took so an ITS? What was it? They noticed I was a real weirdo in the first grade <laughs> uh, yeah. because I understood the concept of negative numbers. So they put me in a room and made me play with blocks and tell them how many feet were on the elephant a bunch of times. And I guess that was an IQ test. They put me mm. in the special good boy class. Uh, is what my mommy called it, but okay. I think I don't know. No, but my my actual IQ test from then, which I don't know how accurate IQ testing of fucking seven year old in an elementary school in Independence, Missouri is. Yeah. I was a one thirty nine, which is that's pretty good. Apparently, no, very good. It's great, yeah. Do you remember? Did you ever? That was like eleven. You're but, like eleven from. But that was when I was a Stranger Things. That was when I was a. <laughs> Very little kid. I have a feeling that if I did it now, I would fucking have like a, I don't know, what's average, 95 or 100 or whatever the fuck. I don't know. I'd get something more average. <laughs> Do you feel like you've gotten dumber with age, Paul? Oh, yeah. Well, I don't remember a lot of shit. That's for sure. Okay. So I guess that means dumber, right? I don't, I mean. Uh, sure. I mean, I mean, a part. lot of stuff sticks in there as far it's as, still there you know, somewhere. Yeah. Kind of muscle memory type of uh -huh. deal where it's in my head where it just comes out and know how to you know yeah it's just you gotta yeah. you gotta figure out how to work it out right mm. like you know riding a bike playing the guitar doing whatever yeah. you know it's just there i'm not don't forget just that. like fucking yeah. a bike you just like keep an algebra in the, in the tank uh yeah i mean it's been a long time since i had to use it i mean even though like i said i learned work in a lab i don't really it's just <laughs> like, there yeah everything's automated yeah you okay yeah, better, so. yeah. oh yeah you don't even have to really yeah. like it used yeah. to be where you had to you had to like measure everything oh right? yeah yeah Bunsen burners and shit. God, I was horrible in science classes, though. That was the one thing I was bad at. Yeah? Yeah, that and baking. I don't like... You don't like baking? I don't like to have to... I, like, when I cook, I like to just, like, fucking wing it, man. I just yeah. like... I like to... I, I cook like jazz. You can't cook like <laughs> jazz with fucking baking. You gotta... It's gotta be classical fucking music. You give this <laughs> some fucking Debussy-type shit. <laughs> They're like, you want cookies? Claire de Lune, motherfucker. And you got to do it to the note or else it comes out flat. That's... Nah, I'm Miles Davis in the kitchen. <laughs> <laughs> All right, what's the test, Paul? What's okay, yeah, yeah. I didn't get this off the line. I, didn't, I wish I'd known that you'd get those. <laughs> uh, these are, this one, uh, it went a lot easier. I wouldn't have to write these. Okay. <laughs> I would Excellent. Okay. I cannot wait to take this test. Yeah, and you both this is a they, this is a duel. Okay, deal. so this is like a okay. combo okay. IQ. Are these and these are questions you What's the high thought of? Or Oh yeah, what What's our high score? What's the highest score we can get on your IQ test? Um four. Um <laughs> five? Okay, okay. cool. <laughs> so right. we're either, we're either five. <laughs> five there's five questions, I think. Okay, okay. perfect. Okay. I'm ready. Are you ready, Brandon? Yeah, I'm ready. is it first? Answer is it raise hand? Or uh, no, just, no, you can both you both answer. You can oh. both answer. Sure, okay. sure. I mean, yeah. Cool. I've never I've never done an IQ test or take. Well, I, <laughs> when I was in college, I did one. A friend gave it to me, but uh -huh. then I would always interrupt them. And I was like, "Oh no, that's not right. Right? Is that? Can you give me a hint on this one or whatever?" Oh, and, and it's timed. So and then they were like, "Got a real low." Yeah. Score. Then I'd have mixed redo it and stuff. So yeah. I take a lot of time to do things. You sometimes yeah. it just depends on what it is. Mm. Mm. <laughs> yeah okay 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 uh this is actually <laughs> this uh is an speaking IQ, of five this minutes is going, ago he was gonna read his <laughs> i'm about to read, i'm about ready to fix stupid here guys <laughs> here you go aaron rogers it. aaron rogers dad okay <laughs> number one number one question number one <laughs> have you ever locked yourself out of your car yeah yeah <laughs> <laughs> multiple, multiple times, times in many ways. <laughs> I, I, I I left it running multiple times mm -hmm. and locked myself out. Did you feel pretty dumb? I literally I felt feel pretty stupid. I felt pretty stupid. Okay. I, when I was leaving Texas and we were so broke we couldn't pay the rent, we had no money, I fucking locked our car keys in the trunk oh, while packing. In the getting, trunk? We were literally getting ready to drive Why are you driving home. in the trunk? I wasn't. I was packing the trunk. And you had to use your keys to unlock the car back then because it was a little fucking hoopty ass. And so, yeah, I locked my key. And so I had to pay, like, some of our last money and just pray to God we had enough money for gas on the way oh, home. That God. was the worst. But, yeah, I'm dumb. I lock my keys in the car a lot. I've done yeah. that. Makes you feel dumb. Multiple yeah. times. Yep. You guys are at zero. <laughs> Wait, hold on, wait. Oh. Okay. <laughs> but I said multiple times, so that's a point each, right? I don't get a point no, for each it. time I locked my mm -mm. keys in the car? Oh, so if we didn't, we'd get one point? I mean, because you 
but we have. Well, I've done it before, and I feel real dumb. Yeah. And so. You know, you got a good point. This if you've be, done it and I've done it, I feel smart, stupid about right? it. This yeah. is for you're right. No, you're right. No, you're right. We're fixing it. And we don't need to lower the bar here. You're, you're right. right. We got to fix our stupid. Sorry. No, you're fine. No, it's okay. I can it's change okay. it. No, no, no. no, no, no I mean, no, I no, wrote no. it. We need to keep it true. <laughs> we need to keep true. To, let's keep some integrity here. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Number two. <laughs> have you uh, have you ever got up in the middle of the night to pee? Yes. And walk by a mirror in the dark and it just scares the shit out of you and then you just piss on the floor? <laughs> I've not done that, actually. <laughs> Is this just a me one? <laughs> How many times have you, done have you pissed uh, on your no, floor? Uh-uh. No, <laughs> no, not done that. Have you done that, Brandon? I've, I've, okay. I've peed on my floors for other reasons, but not, uh, <laughs> not out of fear. Okay, you guys can have a point for that. <laughs> have you ever peed on your floor out of fear? Guys, I'm gonna, I'm not, I'm gonna tell you, I got zero on this when I could oh, give it to myself. Okay, okay, okay. okay. I, Let's hear question three. Then I, I want to I mean, hear what you can't do. Scare the shit! Out. You look up there and something's moving. You're like, to be fair, if I, look, I've never... if I looked in the mirror and I saw you, I would probably jump too. <laughs> <laughs> I've never peed out of fear though, in general. Who's this handsome man in my mirror? <laughs> this is, he's this far too handsome. Man. He is full. It's like too staring handsome. into the eyes of an angel. <laughs> <laughs> he looks so much better in the dark. <laughs> <laughs> number three we're closing in closing in okay number three are we gonna do an intermission after, after this have one? you have you ever looked at your wrist to see what time it was and then realize you didn't have a watch on and then you look around to see if anyone saw you and then you do the hand up like you're yawning <laughs> Even though no one did see you, you still do the yawning thing. I've, I, I've never consistently worn a watch, so I, I, I have not done that. I one. feel like that's an NA for both of us because I've, ne- I've never, I've never worn a watch. We're of the age where, when we got to old enough to have a watch, cell phones. But I will say this: I, didn't, I wish I could afford a little, but I still did it. I don't didn't have a watch. <laughs> I, I will say, you did, were you looking for the sundial? Oh shit! And you look like this. And you're like, <laughs> I will say I've never done. I will say this though, like when I d- did wear a watch because I, I got like I got like a <laughs> I sold my car and then I was like, oh, I'm gonna spend big and get myself something. I got like a really like kind of cheap. Uh, it was like a cheap nice watch and I would wear it all the time, but it wasn't even to. I would I would occasionally run people to like flex of just like oh what's the time oh what's the time mm-hmm. and I wouldn't even look at What's the time. time I would do that mm-hmm. and then I would immediately have to pull up my phone and be like what time really is because I because <laughs> I, 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 I well no I know how to read it. I just forgot it and I was like if I, if I look at my watch again <laughs> I I was, I, there are people looking like why is this insecure guy looking at his tiny wrist like what's he doing so I was like always had to be like oh, all right what's happening here okay <laughs> Brandon this is timed oh, well. <laughs> <laughs> you uh Am I messing, the, am I messing up our numbers? Down. Did I drop okay. it down to a zero? Number four. Number four. <laughs> four, okay. This four. is for both of you will have a thing to say okay. here. Okay. Uh, say something smart. <laughs> something smart. Some, oh, man. Is that the... Uh, I, he got you. I, did, got, I hate that because it's always a trick question. I hate trick questions. That was, I don't like tricks, Paul. I re, I That's why every Halloween yeah. I get scared. You I got me too it, on it because I thought you guys were just going to say something... Like E equals MC squared? Groundbreaking. Is that exactly what you told me to? I guess that's I am oh, man. excellent at following directions. Okay. You have six... That is not true. Yeah. <laughs> I just said I can't bake. You have six <laughs> eggs. You Ooh. break two. Break uh-huh. two. You fry two. Fry two. You eat two. Uh-huh. You eat two. How many eggs you got left? Four. I, I mean, you could also just break eggs and fry the eggs and eat the eggs. I'm just like, assuming those are all know. the same eggs, it's right? A trick question. Trick question, Paul. I can play your game too. This is your treacherous. That wasn't on my. Wow. Well, okay. And then the, the the doctor said, "He's my son." How you guys remember that one? <laughs> <laughs> it was his mom. Never mind. Oh, okay. He was standing on a block of ice in the middle of the room. Okay. Again, I like. You said you one, of the, <laughs> one of the coins was a nickel, but the other wasn't. Those jokes. Those those riddles. You know them. I, I know them. I'm aware of them. They were about me. When, uh, <laughs> that's, a, that's how smart I am. That's true. What's the, uh, <laughs> why? Paul killed himself from by standing on a block of ice. <laughs> <and letting him know. laughs> 
<laughs> Wally had a dime oh, and a nickel okay. in his pocket. <laughs> Matt, I need to remind you, you're being timed. I, okay. okay. That's what my wife keeps saying. And the last one. <laughs> <laughs> Wrap last it up. One. Last one to fix stupid. The IQ test mm-hmm. above all. Okay. Wait, is this another you may IQ need test? A pen. Do you need a pen? I've got a pen here sure. if you need to write some stuff down. I, okay. Okay. Are you ready? Ready. Okay. You're in a plane. Okay. It's flying south mm-hmm. at 473 miles per hour. Okay. At the same time... An American bald eagle oh, is flying north at 84 miles per hour. Okay. Got that? Yeah. Okay. If they are five miles apart. Okay. What is the dimensions of your carry-on luggage? Hopefully within the parameters that the TSA set out before <laughs> I purchased my ticket. I'm gonna say this is bullshit about United. I like they like even on economy, <laughs> they don't let you uh, like they they'll make you measure your carry on no, bag. This okay, I'm gonna say this one I made up because I, I drew, I'm going to Seattle. Are you I, <laughs> I trying to figure it out here on Tuesday? And I just I got I buy drew a, a, an oh, you eagle, drew a ball eagle, and okay. he's taking a poop on an airplane. <laughs> what do you guys think? This is also maybe is this related so to So that's artistic intelligence. I'll say I'll say this about <laughs> spatial intelligence. And <laughs> fecal intelligence. <laughs> yeah, fecal. I, I view my wife as as the smarter person in our relationship and I, I think it, probably it, most people do. I, it, and it always comes up in like other like instances that like you would least expect. And mm-hmm. like when, so we've flown together a few times and every time we get ready to fly, mm-hmm. I always kind of just sit back and I'm just like, oh, she is smarter, just how she packs. Yeah. Are you a, a overpacker or an underpacker? Or do you pack, do you feel like when you go someplace, you're like, I packed just amount of right that I need, or I packed too much, or I packed too little? Because my wife, like, every time, like, it doesn't matter if we're going to Hawaii or here or Seattle, wherever, it's like there's always a perfect amount that she has. And, mm-hmm. and, and for me, I always feel like I'm e- on either spectrum. And I feel like that's an intelligence thing because I am unsure. Because it's definitely spatial intelligence. I'm a hundred. It's a hundred percent spatial. I don't know what I need. I, I feel uh, like if I need, need I, I make sure I go places where I can probably purchase something if I needed to. If sure. I didn't pack it, mm. I do. Uh, I do two things when traveling for work. If I'm staying one night or two nights. I only bring a backpack, Smart. and I can fit everything that I need in that backpack so that I don't have to do anything in the overhead. I just have the one carry-on under the seat in front of me, bing, bang, boom, easy to go. <laughs> it's more than two nights. I do do the overhead carry-on, um, and th- at that point, I will overpack because I know I can pack enough into the little bag. So when I have the big bag, that's fucking heavy. Gloves man. off, you're just yeah. Going crazy. Oh yeah, that's just that's like taking your belt off after Thanksgiving. You're like, there's more fucking room in here, baby. Dude. Stuff daddy up. Let me get that turkey leg, baby. So yeah, he's dumping your drawers. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> yeah, drawers. exactly that. So uh, what was the dimensions? I- uh, you know we can we can look it up. I probably have it on it's my okay. southwest. I think it's twenty four by sixteen. Uh, okay, I'll, make, I'll make I'll make sure. Seems small. Yeah, I'll make sure that I know before my next <laughs> trip. Uh, <laughs> uh, so I think. We've gotten to the bottom of the fact that none of us are all too bright. No, uh, but that's okay. I because didn't we've need this learned. For that to... But but we we did learn the the ways we could become brighter. We learned yeah. that there's nine different ways yeah. that we can become smarter people. Uh, we can get intrapersonal and figure out which ways need the most work. Mm-hmm. Uh, and you know we'll work on it. Now I know among us we have zero degrees. But zero guess degrees. what? That's, that's so... But guess what? Guess what? Zero degrees. Is freezing in Celsius, and that sounds pretty fucking cool to me. That's pretty fucking cool to me too. So we got to the bottom of why mm-hmm. we're so fucking cool, and it's because we're not a bunch of fucking nerds like all you four-eyed mathletes that are out there banging, 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 banging. Yeah, no, yeah we don't have sex at all. <laughs> I don't even know what it is. I don't even know what it is. Uh huh. Fucking loser. <laughs> so, Brandon, thank you for joining the Bottom Boys this thank week. Thank you both so uh, much. I love you guys. Yeah, I'm, it's very exciting that you're here. Yeah, um, never met you both. This is great. <laughs> First time. Grab him off the street. Yeah. Uh, uh, <laughs> everyone watching at home, it's time for all the plugs. We got the website bottomboyscast.com. 
dot com. You can purchase your t shirts. You can purchase your stickers. stickers. You can purchase the I'm a Snake Hat for one million dollars. Uh, I'm just kidding. Don't do that. Do it. Do it. Do it. Logan Paul. Do it. Um, no, but uh, then follow us on Arson Club KC, uh, TikTok, uh, yeah, all of it, Instagram, and then. We need a name for our followers too. Uh, yeah, we. If you guys have an idea for a name for Arson Club's followers, uh, Flamers. The, yeah, Flamers is my is my pitch. If someone can beat the Flamers, let me know. But yeah. if y'all are good with being Flamers, mm. I'm all in I'm on, on being yeah, the great. flamiest Flamer. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Uh, I I like it. I, I think I think I've said fire starters, but it may be too a little too long. Yeah, I kind of I kind of like I kind of like being King Flamer. I'm not gonna lie. That's sick. That's yeah, pretty dope. Yeah, like yeah. I could like get like a I could like get like a like a crown with like some flames That's on it. Pretty cool. And then then we could like Ooh. title a comedy special King Flamer. Ooh, Ooh yeah, we we're working on some shit. We're working on Ooh. some shit. Uh, no, but we speaking of the Arson Club is. Don't call it a comeback. Coming back, uh, we're going to be at the Rhino yeah. in North Kansas City. Um, as of right now, the tentative date, September 23rd. I'll let you know if anything changes. But until then, for Brandon Murphy, for Paul Shields. Hey, maybe we should, because Brandon didn't do it on the inside, maybe we sing ourselves out. Oh. Maybe we. Yeah. What do you think? I don't Brandon, know, what do we sing up for? We yeah, sing we Bottom singing? Boys and then we end with an out. Yeah. So I'll like lay down a beat mm-hmm. and then y'all just come over the top of it a little okay, bit. Okay, I'll, like, right, I'll try better this time. Okay. Okay. Maybe mm-hmm. we'll do it in a round. Oh, yeah. Okay, okay. So so I'll start. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. Who follows? Brandon follows or you follow? Sure. Okay. I guess. Sure. We'll see what happens. Yep. Bottom Boys. Bottom Boys. This was the cast. <laughs> This bottom was the boys, now bottom we are boys. This was the cast. This was the cast. We are going to call it off. We are going to call it off. We are going to cut it off. Bottom boys out. Out.